Hello, everyone, and welcome to Tabor Talk. Beautiful day here in the Catskills. Saturday, what is it, April 9th, 10th, something like that. Doesn't really matter, right? Uh, so people who know me and follow me know that I am a uh, film buff, huge. And uh, I, used, I started a blog in 2009 called What Do We Think? And I did film reviews. I did other stuff, too, in my blog. But, a lot, you know, I concentrated. I spent about 30 40% of my time on on film. So this is the book to get. This is, and I just got this in the mail a couple of days ago, and the it's the author is Jurgen Muller, Toshin Jurgen Muller. And you can take a look at the movies here from the 70s. So my favorite decade uh, for film are the 70s, right? So uh, and I think partially because I grew up in the 70s. I was a, I was a child. And that's when I really started watching movies. Uh, I was born in 1963. In the 70s, my father uh, would almost on a week, yeah, almost every week he would take us to the movies. And I got into all these rated R movies, you know, French Connection. Uh, he would not take me to The Exorcist. That's one thing. Uh, but all of those movies, Ap Apocalypse Now was later on, but, but uh, Death Wish, <laughs> it was weird how my father, you know, I'm seven, eight, nine years old and my father's bringing me to the movies. So, okay, so I'm going to go through this, maybe not the whole thing. I'll just start from the beginning and then, and then we'll take it from there. Okay. Okay, here it is, the movies of the 70s to begin. A shot. And there is from Clockwork Orange, right? The painting there, the mural. Is that the mural on the, on the wall? So, okay. It starts out with the first. With, right there's, there he is. Alex. Movies of the 70s. This is a great shot here. Look at that. Urban sprawl. Futuristic. Utopia turned bad. Great shots. All right. Alex a snake. Ludwig, right? Beethoven. All right. This is all in the movie here. And there's the remember the Jesus. Oh, I get one there. All of that when he's fantasizing. Okay, so there you go. As you can take a look, 71 to actually 1980. All right, straw. Straw Dogs. Good movie. I've seen most of the movies, not all, but I eventually will. And not every movie of the 70s is in here, but the, the important ones. And what do, what do we have here? The Beguile. Oh, I love that movie. Nice one. Just amazing photos in this book here. I wish there was a better way of doing this. More on the beguiled. <laughs> Rocky. No, get Carter. Uh, uh, for some reason, I thought that was Stallone. Clute. There's Jane Fonda. Look at Jane there. <laughs> Here 
we are. Dirty Harry, of course. The first one. Silent Running. I've not seen this movie. Okay, and uh, Shaft, of course. Just fantastic photos here. And here we are again with Clockwork Orange. Oh, there's Alex. Here we are, the French Connection. I just saw that a couple of weeks ago. And I just ordered the French Connection too. Um, just actually today. So the directors were different. Let's see. William Friedkin uh, directed the first one, and then John Frankenheimer did French Connection 2. Great shots. And here we are. Play it against Sam. Well, there you go. Um... Obviously, I'm not going to go through the whole book, although I intended to, and I was going to have commentary, but that would take many, be many, many hours long, right? So, uh, I mean, come on. Uh, Deliverance, I just saw that a couple of months ago. I'm, I'm, let's see here. Seen it several times. Cabaret, I don't know remembers that. Rise of the Known. Uh, Godfather, how many times have you seen The Godfather? Godfather 1 and 2 is great. Godfather 3 sucks, as we all know. And Godfather 3 came out 1990, I believe, 1991. So the first two were in the 70s. Oh, Frenzy. Hitchcock had uh, a getaway. So if you're a film buff, how can you, how do you not get this, this book here? So Solaris, yeah, the... the, the Russian version, who was the, um, the director here, what's his name? Yeah, Andrei Tarkovsky. And then Steven Soderbergh did Solaris, the American version, I think in the early uh, 2000s. So by the way, this series here, right, they have it for, for, all, for each decade. They have movies of the 40s, movies of the 50s. Uh, movies of the 60s, obviously the 70s, 80s, 90s, and I think the 2000s. So, uh, so I've been greeting how great was that movie, right? Eating uh, human beings. So I'll be doing, uh, shortly, starting to set up my blog right now for going to Enter the Dragon. Uh, boy, what this movie had such an impact on me. Uh, you know, I'm a lifetime martial artist, and I started out with Kung Fu. I actually started with karate, then Kung Fu, and the movie to see is Enter the Dragon. I saw that with my father. So, Dead for Me, True Fire, Westworld. Yeah, this is the original Westworld. What was that? Uh, 1973. Okay, so you get the point. I'm not going to go through the whole thing. Let me just, this is a thick one, too. Here it is. How oh, great is that? Okay. Good friends, good books, and a sleepy conscience. Peace, love, and understanding here on Tabor Talk.